Hey, this is Kathy from Kathy Cooks For You. I am going to show you my favorite easy quick meal that I love to make that's inside of Aldi. So let's go check it out. Okay, first thing we're gonna get is our spinach and cheese manicotti. It is amazing. It's $5.29 now, a little bit pricier than it used to be because of inflation, but still worth the money for sure. Then we have a couple cheese choices. This is our fresh mozzarella cheese. You slice this up. It's a little too soft to grate. And my favorite is their um, organic shredded mozzarella cheese. But if you want to go for their cheaper versions, they have the bulk, which is a two pound bag. And then they have the blocks underneath that you shred that are also okay to use. I love the organic tomato sauce. I buy that, it has zero sugar, super yummy. Welcome to my kitchen. We just went to Aldi and we have some great goodies. I have my favorite easy meal I'm gonna show you today that's all Aldi ingredients. Okay, let's cut into these. And they're in like two separate sides. So if you only wanted to use one side, if you were a single person, or maybe it's just for two and you guys don't eat much, um, you can use just one side and that side could be another day. But for my husband and I, we make both and then we fight over uh, the leftovers the next day. So we have those. Before we put those oh, in our pan, we are gonna put just a little layer of our spaghetti sauce down just so we can not have things stick. This is how easy it is. I'm going to place these in. See how they kind of have a wrapper? That's nice if you get the wrapper down. So we're getting these all in here, easy peasy. This is it. Pour some sauce over it as much as you like. What I do is then I put the lid on this and freeze it and use it for something else. And that's it. The meal is done. Make a salad. You can get some frozen veggies out of the freezer. I mean, how easy is that? Open a bag of carrots and you have a meal that is not going to seem like it took, what, that, besides my babbling, this took minutes to put together. We're going to put it in the oven at 350. Um, basically, you're just heating this up. If you'd like, you can put some meat in your sauce, you know, fry up some sausage if you'd like to jazz it up. If you have um, any leftover meat in the Bridge, you can put that in here. It's up to you. I'm putting a little more cheese just because I like the cheesy gooey mess. Okay, we'll get that in the oven and then I'll show you what it looks like when we're done. Okay, we are ready to get our food out. It's been still probably 40, 45 minutes. Okay, let's put this on our plate. Two. I'm going to try to be good and only eat two. And I have some peas and carrots over there. Just frozen peas and carrots because this is supposed to be a super quick meal. Mm. That is the best three minute meal I have had. Now, how you can change this a little bit? Why not, after you put a little bit of tomato sauce on the bottom, I should have, and I even have a, put a layer of uh, spinach, and then another layer of tomato sauce, to me, did I just say tomato, <laughs> tomato sauce, and then put the pasta on top. Oh, that would have been so good, darn it. But there's another idea for you. So thank you so much for watching Kathy Cooks For You. Please subscribe below to my channel and give me a thumbs up and I would love to hear from you with a comment.